35 looks on what to wear to the office coming right up. Welcome to Comfy Boost. This is Laura and Marta here with you today. And as we both are working in corporate environments, we face an issue every day that we have to find what to wear to work. So if you have just started working in an office or you're looking for some inspiration, then stay with us. Depending on the company you work in, you may need to be adjusting to a business professional or smart casual outfits. If you're working in a big bank, a big corporation, or even a big public sector organization, or basically any other office that requires or demands a business professional outfit, you may be thinking of buying a business suit, a pantsuit, or a really nice smart or professional dress with a jacket. This is what it looks like. Try to dress in navy, white, black, gray, and brown. Patterns should be in one solid color or feature minimal pinstripes. If you are wearing a dress, it needs to be below knee height. And regarding shoes, closed-toed shoes. For your bag, you can have a briefcase in a neutral color or a handbag. Depends on if you need to take your laptop home or not. Your accessories should be minimal and not attention-grabbing. Hair always needs to be in a neat hairdo unless you have a pixie or very short hair. Also. Don't go crazy with your nail polish colors and makeup. It needs to look natural and professional. If you are working in less formal environment, but still meet with the business clients and partners, or your company requires a business casual look, then you should think polished yet relaxed attire. For example, if you have a business suit from the previous job, you don't need to keep it in your closet, but you can adjust it in different ways. You can either ditch the pants and swap them with more casual design pants or you can change the blouse to a more casual t-shirt or top. Or you can also ditch the blazer too. You can add different accessories like scarves and jewelry. Regarding skirts, you can mix and match them with different color tops or blouses and you can also add different blazers and jackets or even sweaters. And with business casual look, you're actually not limited anymore to specific colors, so you can go ahead and try different ones and uh, go ahead and take a look at what looks better on you. But always remember not to use neon colors or transparent fabrics, as that will look already too much and not appropriate to business environment. If you feel more comfortable wearing pants, you can also mix and match them with different style and color blouses. You can add jackets, different blazers and vests. Usually in business casual look, only fabric pants are considered as suitable. But if you know that in your office also jeans and other materials are okay to go, you can try any of these looks with them too. Another cool attire that you can actually wear to the office is a jumpsuit. Again, you can mix it with different blazers or jackets. And regarding shoes, both heels and flats are fine, as long as you feel comfortable and good in them. But the more classical ones you choose, the better and the higher possibility that you will not go wrong with them when going to the office. If in your office people do like to show their personalities with different accessories, then interesting shoes will be your best friends. Experiment with any tidy clothes, shoes or boots that feel comfortable for you. Avoid unstable heels and leave sports style footwear for days off and fitness. If there is autumn or winter outside, we recommend to try some lighter or warmer sweaters, some boots and coats. They will not only keep you warm, but also comfort you in rainy days. Also, feel free to experiment with different accessories, combine outfits with different styles of bags and add some more color to your makeup and you can also experiment with your hairdo, but don't overdo it because as long as it looks tidy and neat, you are on the right way. So in summary, in business professional outfits, stick to fully professional look and respect the business colors. Plus, don't overdo with your makeup, with your hairdos and your manicure. On the other hand, on the business casual look, you can experiment more with different colors, different styles, different textures, and still keeping a business vibe to it. Don't wear transparent or too short or too tight outfits. 
don't have open shoulders on too deep necklines. Thank you for being here with us and we really hope that we inspired you and you're ready to rock. And if you liked and, and got inspired by uh, some of our outfits, don't forget to comment below which ones were the ones that you really liked. And also don't forget to like this video. And if you're new to our channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for new lifestyle beauty tips and tricks. Thank you for watching and see you next week. Bye! Bye!